<laughs> With Thanksgiving meals already wiped clean from plates all around the borderland, Black Friday is kicking off. If you're used to long lines and major store discounts, this Black Friday may look a little different than those in the past. ABC 7 Sarah Coria joins us live with more details. Sarah. Well, Dylan, at one point, Black Friday started as early as Thursday, immediately following those Thanksgiving dinners, sometimes even before those meals were complete. Well, today, our ABC 7 crews headed out to see if that Black, that Black Friday tradition was still the same. Here's what happened. Take a look. Online shopping is probably the way of the future. Empty parking lots, closed doors, no lines. This Black Friday, the outlet shops, Best Buy and Target all closed. Not a shopper in sight. The major retailers not set to open until Friday morning. So is Black Friday a thing of the past? Everybody used to do it when I was a kid. I just don't really care for all the people. A holiday retail survey by Delotti's expects an average of 1,455 to be spent per household for the holidays. The National Retail Federation says businesses started their holiday Black Friday deals earlier, all because of shoppers' fear of inflation and the need to buy items before prices rise. Retailers have been having these early Black Friday sales for more than a month now, and so there have been more ads, more promotions, more claims of deals than I think I've ever seen in all my time tracking sales. A recent survey found that 80% of buyers plan to shop during Cyber Monday instead of on Black Friday. This is 10% more than last year. I can just go out throughout the whole week, wait till Cyber Monday, shop then, you know, and save time. And since we've been here, we've seen some workers head into inside, no doubt preparing for tomorrow's early morning shoppers who are determined to keep Black Friday traditions alive. Reporting live in West El Paso, Sarah Coria, ABC7. Okay, thank you very much for that report, Sarah.